So, I have been playing a long time now, and uh, I always use somebody else's loot filter. Um, I have been using NeverSync's Uber Strict because when I'm running around in uh, I'm making two breaches every map, I get a little bit confused sometimes. Uh, I want to, to know what it is when it drops. And I think before I was thinking, oh, it's too hard to make it myself and everything. And uh, I need something that needs to be very easy or, or I cannot do it. So I tried a little bit today. I'm looking a little bit and I found something cool. The best site ever. But I will show you guys first uh, what I mean. For example, here, you're running around in spider forest and you open a bridge, lot of creatures, and you're shooting and uh, having fun, and you hear one exalt sound, and always you want uh, that want to be a doctor. And when you're doing Ubisoft now, you just hear the exalt sound, and you're thinking, okay, what is it? Is it the doctor? Is it divine? Or is it exalt? Or what is it? Or the cool items? But you want just want the doctor, and um, I want to know when I hear the sound. I will want to know exactly what it is when it drops. So, for example, I have go into uh, and change on this site. I will show you guys later on. Just stay with me a little bit longer here. Uh, for example, Doctor. Then I know when I hear this sound in uh, Spider Forest, I know this is the Doctor because I changed the sound for it. And um, for example, Exalted Orb. Exalted orb, an exhilarating sensation of victory. If yes. Only for a brief moment. Victory. I like that one. So, I have changed a little bit on those two just so I know when I'm running in Spider Forest, I know what it is when it's dropping straight away. So, let's just jump into the fun thing, and that is looking why and how. You're doing this the easiest way. I will show you guys this site in my video below, so you can just go in it and uh, it's more easy. You don't need to go into this video many times and look. So I will show you just how to do it. Uh, you go into this site, you go to overview, and of course, this is NeverSync who made this site. Uh, I hope he's not mad that I am uh, trying to show everybody else here this site, but this is just marvelous. It's perfect. It's making loot filter for dummies like me. So let's move on. You put in the filter here, and I've been running Ubistrict. And when I do this, then everything here now is Ubistrict. When I go to customer, customer size, then Everything here is uber strict, but I want to do some changes. For example, in currency. Uh, here, you can change everything, for example, on currency. You can uh, have smaller uh, on the map or lesser or whatever you want. You can have different colors. You can go here, you can put it uh, like red, blah, blah, blah. Or you can change here in blue, for example. Who knows? Who cares? Uh, I want it like white, then I know something is very very expensive. So when you have chosen a little bit here what you want to do, you can drag it as well. I have doing that. For example, Mirror of Calandra never drops for me, so I don't care. So I just put everything like in exalted uh, sound when I, so I know it's dropping. Of course, you can change, for example, Drag this exalted down here and uh, for example change the sound. The mirror of Calandra. Yes. Ultimate. Immeasurable. And then you know a mirror drop, for example. It's pretty cool. Maybe I will do it next season. Uh, just for fun. And you can drag like everything under here again and you can put up different sound and everything. But for now I will have it like this. Uh, just because I think it's nice uh, to have it like that. And you can, for example, change, you can move up and down items. You can as well hide. For example, 
if you want to hide all this kind of stuff and or both scouring as well you can drag it down here and you can hide then you will not see it on the map and it's pretty nice when you're running around and open a bridge so much loot and uh, you're using so much time if you don't have the the loot fi filter on your own if you're using somebody else it's always something you're not happy with you you my recommendation is make it your own, your own sound and everything, then it's more fun to play overall as well. So when you have done that, you have changed, you put in uh, what currency you like and everything here, you can move on. This was just the currency, you can go to unique items, do changes there, you can go to divination card. And here for example I have put, here is the doctor. Uh, when I'm running spider forest, nothing else here will drop in the spider forest except the doctor. So when I hear this sound, I know, okay, perfect. It's um, it's the doctor. I know it when I when I hear the sound. So it's pretty nice. And if you're running, for example, the wealth or uh, the vault, I mean, you hear abundant wealth dropping. You hear, oh, poof, okay, perfect, nice. Then I know. The, the, that dropped so it's pretty nice as well uh, and you can change you can go and change everything as you like but when you're running something and you're hunting for the doctor you want a special sound just for that one so but that's just me that's the cool thing you can change you can do whatever you like here it's pretty easy and when you have done what you feel and all the changes you want for example some bases as well you can hide or you can show for example you want to show when you see a bony tower shield or gold amulets and stuff like that dropping maybe you want to see it but no sound then you can put on no sound here it's no sound but you will see it with a green spot around for example so it's pretty cool and it's pretty easy uh, everything is up to you here. Uh, it's pretty understandable as well, so you don't need a lecture of me how to do things. This is pretty forward, it's pretty easy, you can do whatever you like here as well. When I've done it, go to save and load, put up your stuff here, for example like I did, uh, the test and uh, save it, and then you go to download. You push download here, then it will pop up your file, and then you just open it up. This is videos, this is something else, blah 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 blah. And we want uh, this one, not this one, this one. And when you put it, when you put it up, you take save and you put your random name and dot filter and uh, drag it just in the PO, POE and uh, in the loot filter map and when you do, do that it's pretty easy you see mine is here then you just go into the game and you can change you can have different for each character for example one farming yeah you know this drill already I just wanted to show you the site that's all folks um, I wish you good luck and I um, I'm going to use this forward. This is up to you what you want to do. Adios, amigos.